Okay, now we have fresh pictures coming in of Shankar Adya who has now reached court. Remember, he was the one who was arrested yesterday by the ED on charges of being associated with the ration scam and then too the ED team was attacked. He was arrested yesterday and the Trinamool Congress says that once again the government is selectively using the ED and the CBI as investigative agencies to target their political opponents. So these are the first pictures coming out of Shankar Adya who has just reached the court. Uh, we're going to try and get some more perspective on that but this is exactly the context. In Bengal over the last two to three days there has been a confrontation between the West Bengal government and the BJP on the other hand. In fact the governor too has attacked the West Bengal governments uh, uh, and said that attacks on ED officials stopping them from doing their duty is completely unacceptable. Ahead of the Lok Sabha elections, the BJP is going to use this incident to step up their attack on the Trinamool Congress saying that they are not capable of providing a safe law and order situation in the state. Yesterday, up after Sheikh Shah Jahan, the people arrested or rather sorry attacked the ED team when they went to conduct a raid his house there was another ED team which went to a residence of Shankar Adhya who is an uh, accused on, uh, of uh, the allegations against him in the Russian scam and there too the ED team was at, uh, attacked okay Komalika is back with us Komalika any reactions coming in from the Sinemul Congress even as we see pictures of Shankar Adhya reaching court and there also, the Central Congress is coming up with this theory of uh, how uh, central agencies are only going and raiding uh, houses of the Trinamool leaders and not to Shubhendu Odhikari, who is again, he was seen on that Narda um, Singh operation. So this is what their uh, theory is. And they are also saying that because the people have got frustrated with so many of uh, ED uh, raids in various uh, Trinamool leaders' place. So, since they are leaders, they are, this is a local reaction to of the people. Since yesterday night also, uh, there was a attempt to attack on the uh, officials who arrested the uh, Shankarado. Now, this Shankarado, who is this Shankarado? That is very important, Pallavi. He is former uh, municipality chairman of uh, Bonga, and he was also very close to the former food minister, Jyoti Priyo Mollik. Now, both Shah Jahan and Shankarado, both of them are close to Jyoti Priyo Mollik, who was former food minister and is in custody. So, regarding that, trailing that line of investigation, uh, the ED went to this his uh, his house, but and and it got arrested. But the thing is that the Trinamool Congress is saying this is absolutely political vendetta, and because it's an opposition uh, ruled uh, state, because they're opposition leaders, that's why this type of activities are taking place. It's not that uh, it, 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 they are uh, they have zero tolerance against corruption, but this is not done. And whatever is happening now in the name of investigation is absolutely political vendetta. Okay, thank you very much. Uh Komalika for getting us those details. So this confrontation is not likely to end anytime soon. The BJP will of course make this a huge issue and the governor too has kind of reprimanded the attack on the ED team. But now we are going to shift focus.